Welcome to Home TV. I'm Tracy Prees and here's what's happening in northwestern Ontario today. The OPP attended a weapons call at Beaver Bray Secondary School in Kenora after a student posted a picture on social media yesterday afternoon. The student was taken into custody at the school and interrogated by police. It was determined by police that the student did not have any firearms at the school and was released with a warning. Posts like this can be perceived as threats and are taken very seriously. A passenger flight from Sioux Lookout destined for Pekanjikum was forced to land in Red Lake due to an unruly passenger. Monday evening, the Red Lake OPP were notified that the aircraft was making an unplanned stop at the local airport. The investigation revealed that 33-year-old Tori Turtle of Pekanjikum First Nation had been assaulting passengers and refusing to follow instructions from the airline staff. He was subdued and restrained during the flight by passengers and one of the pilots until the plane could be safely landed. He was subsequently taken into custody and charged with assault, assaulting a peace officer and resisting arrest. The Northwestern Health Unit is reporting 112 active COVID-19 cases in the region today with 86 in Sioux Lookout, 13 in Kenora, 6 in Red Lake, 5 in Dryden and 1 each in Atacokan and Fort Francis. The average daily positivity rate is 10%. And that's your Home TV News update for this hour. For more local news, check out our website at myhometv.ca. And make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel where we post daily news Monday to Friday so you can stay up to date. I'm Tracy Prees. Have a great day.